cracking YouTube. Back another bit with another video, man. We in here checking out the car. Spank done go ahead and he done went on ahead and did his thing on it. Spank done went on ahead and welded the floor pans in from the bottom. I stick it, I got a picture of it. He done uh, went on ahead and put the seam seal on it. But uh, I shoot y'all, I put a picture on it here and show y'all when he uh, welded it in. This seam seal, we put the seam seal around it. And I got the bed liner in the trunk. And we gonna pull that up. We gonna, I'm gonna spray that on there in a few minutes. I gotta let the coilovers up too. But uh, you can let it down, Spank. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start shooting the bottom of it right now. Go ahead and get the come on coming on. I gotta put the brake lines on here too, y'all see? Brake cap over there, I ain't got no brake line on. And I ain't even put the brake cap on this side yet. <laughs> moving the groove man i'm gonna bolt that one up though when i get it back to the crib because i'm gonna put the brake lines on but and damn i left my plate at the crib i, I got the ac delete plate but i left it at the house dang i bring it back we'll snatch this out and put it on them that way that'll be our own done and uh i'm gonna try to get with james next week and try to go ahead and get ready to start painting this thing man i think it's on that side right here spank it's a can huh yeah i think this damn i might have used most of it most of it i'm probably used the other one well this is huh no i get 30 percent off tomorrow i'm gonna get it way cheaper come on back up yeah, I get that 30% discount at AutoZone, y'all. I think it's a game. I think we pretty much got most of the metal stuff out of the way. I do got, like I said, I do got to get this done on the bottom of that door. But we'll figure that out when I get to that point. See, we got the UMI performance sway bar on the front. This is what I'm using too. Truck bed coat, black. I'm gonna have to go get some more because I don't about use most of it in this can. So, uh, but I'm gonna shoot the whole bottom of this car with it. Yeah. Open the shit. See what we got. Uh, that's it. That's it. Okay. Boy, boy, spray that thing so far, boy. Y'all can't lie. I'll be shooting with them cans, though. I'll be shooting with them router cans. Well, I'm cold with that router can. Y'all, check me out. We'll do a couple coats on him, but I'm going to show y'all how we, how we cold with that router can, boy. I'm about to say, boy, it sound like you set some on fire behind me. Yeah. Yeah, I see that router can. Cold with that router can, boy. Yeah. Yes, sir. Talk to me. But. I'm gonna cut y'all back on in a minute, man. All right. All right, guys. Turn it. Y'all see, I sprayed her down a little bit, but I gotta go get some more of the uh, paint because I wanna hit the frame too. I'm gonna hit the frame all the way down. Y'all see, I got it pretty good on this side. 
but I'm gonna hit the frame all the way down to the back, but you see I ran out. So I'm on it right here right now. I still gotta do all this back up in here anyway. But y'all see we pretty much got all this sprayed. Y'all see the flows in there seem sealed in and welded in and painted. But I gotta get some more paint, so I'm gonna cut y'all back on. I gotta go get some more paint, man. And then I'm gonna do this back part. I don't know, man. I need to get this green out of this son of a bitch. But, uh, I don't know. Holla back at y'all in a little bit, man. All right? All right, guys. We back. I went to grab some more, uh, truck bed liner on the coat. And, uh, I pretty much shot the back part of it. I mean, I ain't gonna show y'all all that. But, uh, Y'all see I painted all up in here. Hold on, let me clean the camera off. There we go. All right, y'all see, painted all up up in here. Got all that sprayed. I painted this, I ain't worried about this tank because I'm getting this tank out. I'm putting a new gas tank in it. Y'all see all up in there. We sprayed all that. It's gonna look a little, uh, whatchamacallit because uh it got like a texture on it it's that bed liner i sprayed it all on the bottom so and i ain't worried about these lines because i'm gonna put new gas lines on it i need the frame rail all the way down and y'all see i did the flow pans too frame rail So, pretty much got this all squared, squared away. The next thing I got to do is, uh, like I said, probably get James them to do it. But uh, I'm be taking on feathers and stuff, man, probably to another shop. But those guys still ain't had a chance to even blast my stuff, man. They done had it for at least two months. But uh, I'm pretty much almost finished on what I got to do. I got my front suspension done. I got my uh, frame notch. I got the floors put in. I got the bottom of the car pretty much undercoated. Y'all can see. Pretty much got the bottom of the car undercoated. And uh, that's it. I ain't worried about this rear end. Got this rear end coming out. So, and I ain't worried about this either. I'm gonna clean all this up when I put the uh new trailing arms in that whole area i'm gonna grind that all down and paint it all that i just want to do all that right now because i ain't taking the ring out and i painted up in here because you know this is going to be coming off anyway because we're going to have coil overs so yeah so for the most part man we got everything pretty much done as far as the bottom of the car guy got the front suspension done we're gonna worry about the rear suspension once I get that other rear end and get it put in. But I'm really waiting on that other shop to finish the rear end. So, I mean, finish with a move DJ car so I can get the rear end out of the car to put it in this car. So, that's the hole up on that, honestly. But probably when I get back after the 4th of July, I'm gonna, uh, man, I'm gonna take those parts over there to this other shop I talked to about getting those blasted and everything so I can. Go ahead and get this car to James. I'm gonna holler at James probably tomorrow about getting this car over there, man, so I can go ahead and get this thing ready to get painted. And then I gotta find some wheels. Then I'm still getting stuff together for the car show. Man, y'all come kick it with me at the car show July 23rd. We're gonna be at the Jackson County Fairground. Y'all come holler at me. So I got a lot of stuff going on right now. I'm just recording in the process, man. Pretty much I just record whatever I got going on and I always got something going on, so. Like I said, for the most part, man, I just wanted y'all to check out this process with me. I undercoated the bottom of the box Chevy, too, but I did it all in the driveway. And my dog Spank let me use his lift to make this quicker. You know what I'm saying? I did it in the driveway on the box Chevy. I put it up on jack stand. So just imagine grinding and laying down and then painting. Boy, that was fucked up. But, hey, I got it done. And it's still, the bottom of my car still look good, too, so. Y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. Make sure y'all tune in. 
We're getting this Malibu bill on the way. And like I said, baby, we're moving on to the next step. We're doing one thing at a time. But uh, I'm going to talk to James about fixing his rust on his door. I know they can do it. So I just really wanted to have much stuff as I can have done before I take it to them. So it won't be so much that they have to do to the car. So, But uh, I know it's still going to be a lot they're going to have to do. But anyway, like I said, man, y'all like, comment, subscribe. Make sure y'all tune in to the next couple videos we got dropping. And I'm going to holler back at y'all on the next video. And we got the bottom of the car done. It's all over here now. I got to lift these coilovers up too. So I'm going to holler back at y'all on the next one.